What is happening everyone? Welcome back to another video in my channel. So today's video will show you how to upload an email list to Facebook ads, whether it's a client list or just a list of emails you have collected. I will show you the right way to upload it and create a custom audience from this list. So let's get started. The first thing that we need is having a spreadsheet or Excel file where we're putting all of our contacts. It should look something like this where we have the names, emails. Facebook requires to have at least one data point. So it might be a full name, email or a phone number. I would advise you to at least have an email email or phone number plus their name to get the best results possible. Now what we need to do is to click on file over here and we want to download this spreadsheet as a CSV file. So let's go ahead and click on CSV and we'll save it to our computer. The next thing that we need to do is we need to go to our ads manager. If you don't know how to get to this page, simply Google Facebook ads manager and we'll open up the menu on the left side and we'll click on audiences. And now over here we'll click on create audience and hit custom audience. And let's go ahead and select customer list and hit next. Now over here you have options import from MailChimp, download file template of Facebook and other formats. But if your spreadsheet looks something like my spreadsheet, that's totally fine. So let's go ahead and hit next. And over here, this is where we're going to upload the CSV file that we have downloaded. So we'll click on upload file and let's select our email list and hit open. All right, perfect. Over here, Facebook asks you if your customer have value. For example, if you are uploading a client list and you know that one client spend 5,000 with you, you can go ahead and include that as value. But for the most part, you don't have to use it because it's not that helpful so let's go ahead and hit next over here and now we have this error over here because facebook essentially batch all the info in one column so to be able to separate it all we have to do is to put our mouse right over here and then we want to go ahead and select comma and now you can see this has disappeared and we want to click on action needed and you see it has splitted the information and now all we have to do is to go ahead and select the right column so this is going to be the first name this is going to be last name and this is going to be email and there you go now now it's all perfect and let's go ahead and hit import and create and now let's hit done and voila as you can see we have our customer list over here in our custom audiences so you can go ahead and start using it you can create a lookalike audience for it so hopefully you took some value out of this video if you did make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already check out some other videos right over here thank you so much for watching guys and until the next one peace